Hello and uh, welcome. I almost said welcome back to Dishonored. No, I'm doing my own playthrough this time for Dishonored 2 comes out. Uh, I did actually want to talk about Microsoft right now. Um, they're, uh, I don't know if they had, I don't think they have. Actually, they might have had a person. No, 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 I don't care. I don't care. Thank you, Corvo. Yeah, you're welcome. Anyway, let's try to focus on the vlog and not the game. It's just here, just for extra content, I guess. Anyway, yeah, Microsoft announced that the Xbox One, I'm just going to run around for a while, X, the Xbox One would be the final Xbox. The, there would be and no other console generation. So, that's kind of cool, but... Campbell against the odds. I knew you were our man, Corvo. Let's just walk around. Um... Sometimes I think this can be yeah, so like the start of a joke. This is going to be the final generation, so there's not going to be Xbox Two, Xbox Seven Twenty, or or Box. Yeah, if they actually did, yeah, the next one would have been called Box. No, no, no. There's not going to be any of that, according to Microsoft. Uh, and instead, there's going to be like every two, three years, or whatever. It's going to, I guess, it's going to be like mobile, like you know. Uh, a new phone comes out every year of the brand or something. It's like I, Apple iPhone. The only difference with iPhone is it is a, technically a different generation. It's like maybe the following year they'll come out with a okay iPhone six. It'd be like iPhone five, then fi iPhone five S, iPhone six, iPhone six plus. A year later, iPhone SE, which is technically still the iPhone six in my opinion. And then now, assuming. I, th if they do stick with the numbers, it'd be like iPhone 7 and maybe iPhone 7 Plus or Pro, whatever it's called. And then a year later, yeah, well, th that's a little, that's kind of the same thing, only Apple, only that is still technically different generations. So, but, so, you in a way, you could kind of, um, Think of it that way. This is just... Um, but no. But the thing is, with Microsoft, mobile phones are different. Uh, first of all, my duck. Um, I don't. So, uh, and the Xbox One is not a phone. Or Xbox in general, really. So yes, I understand. I have nothing. I have nothing against like a small upgrade you know every three years in the middle of a console generation you know have a release the xbox one again or playstation 4 or wii u with more memory although I nintendo i don't think did that but that's beyond the point uh yeah that's fine but are they they're gonna get microsoft's gonna continually do it and that's what i have a problem with how far can i go i don't want to go too far um and I just don't see how that's going to work out. Like, so, yeah, you got Xbox One, then there's Xbox One S, and then, what, Xbox One Scorpio, which might be the same thing, I'm not sure. And But, say, next year's going to be another one. That's all there's going to be. Because they want it to be like a PC, because, you know, PC doesn't really have a generation. It's just technically, basically all the same. There is no PC generation, really. Uh, well, for gaming, anyway. So, you have... Um, the PC, unless you count Windows, like Windows, there was Windows Vista, XP, 7, 8, point 1, Windows 10, and 10 point whatever, I don't need to say every version. Uh, yeah, so, then you got that, but that's PC, PC is different, you know, and plus nobody really owns PC, it's like, I guess you could say the same thing with video games. No one really owns video games. Yeah, I own a certain... Like, Nintendo owns Super Mario Brothers and Zelda and Pokemon, or 30% well, of Pokemon, anyway. Um, so, it's like Microsoft owns Halo, Sony owns Uncharted, and Little Big Planet, which nobody really talks about anymore. Uh, and then PlayStation, it's a brand. Xbox, Nintendo, those are brands. Windows is a brand. Apple, iPhone, iOS, Mac OS, etc. It's it's 
that that's that's what they're on. I'm getting off track here, so yeah. But it's like the new Xbox One. There's not gonna be. It's just hard to believe. I, I don't know. I mean, I, I actually a, a couple months ago I did kind of start wondering if this would actually happen. Um, but I don't see how it's gonna work out. It's like you know. Okay, so let's get back to Windows. Uh, okay, I'm playing Dishonor now. So if I went to I don't know, maybe when the next version of Windows comes out or something, it's possible Dishonored may not work or something. You know, ten year, if Windows 10 exists in 10 years from now, it's possible Dishonored may not work anymore. Unless Bethesda decides to do something. But let's say they don't, then you're out of luck, I guess. Or you gotta get a console. Uh, so if you decide to never buy another Xbox One, you're gonna stick to Xbox One, the original one. For 10 years or 15 years even if it even if this even does last long i'm kind of wondering if they are going to change mind going to generations well it's not working too well so the constant generation is going to be 15 years it's never been exactly i think it like it was like seven eight years but it's never exactly been so, what well, it's been about five to seven years that's what i kind of say constant generation um but i just don't see how this will work out so of the Xbox 1.5, whatever the fifth version will be called, are you going to be able to play some of the games? Now, maybe the, like GTA 5, you know, there's no GTA 6 yet. It just got GTA 5 and online. That's Those are the latest releases. So it's possible those games like that could kind of get updates or remasters. But maybe games that don't do very well. I mean, obviously... They would still make money, but what if companies don't want to remaster them? Like, not every game deserves a remaster. It's like Sony, and I'm hoping Sony doesn't do this. I hope the PlayStation 4 Neo is just one upgrade, and that's the last upgrade they're going to do. And then, if there is a PlayStation 5, they'll release the PS4 again just for a cheaper price or something. That's what I think should happen. But Microsoft's not about that. They want to kill console. They, they want to kill consoles. They want to kill generations, actually... At one point, was thinking they were gonna go third. They wanted to go third party because, well, I don't know. I guess, I guess Minecraft's not really enough. But they were asking for Mario on Xbox. No, I, I, that's not gonna happen. I don't want it to happen. I don't want Nintendo to become third party. I don't want Microsoft to become third party. And I don't know. Throughout the past years, I've actually kind of liked Microsoft less and less. Uh, I don't want to see them like go out of business or anything, but. I still respect Microsoft to a certain extent, um, but it, yeah, it's not just, it's mostly Windows, and I never really care for Xbox in general. I mean, I care for it a little. It's all right, but that's not the point. You know me, I'm more PC and Nintendo, and yeah, occasionally PlayStation. Anyway, beyond that, uh, let's get back to the focus, the main point. Yeah, I just, I don't see how this is going to work out, like... Oh, that's a fish. That scared me. Um, I'm trying to think of another example. Okay, say once GTA 6 is announced, you're going to have to buy the new Xbox One. But, I mean, maybe not, but it's possible GTA 6 or GTA 7, whatever, if this actually does work, how long is it going to work? Because what if you don't want to keep spending money on the same system? It's like, oh, too bad. So, in a way, could you say... Xbox One, I know that's not really the point of the video, but Xbox One could be like two console generations in that point, or three, and therefore console generations are not dead. And I know I don't think Nintendo's going to go through with this. And yes, NX, I do consider NX next gen, just because even if it doesn't have the same specs as Microsoft or Sony systems, it, it's still next gen. It has nothing. It doesn't have to be like more powerful. It's something new. If it was like just a re-release of slightly more memory or something, that'd be different. And in a way, I do kind of consider, sometimes I do think of PlayStation 4 Neo and Xbox One S. And for a while, I was kind of considering those next gen and just saying, well, they're different systems, but they don't want to... Yeah, I don't know. I hope Sony's not doing that, but I know Microsoft is for sure. I don't see how that's going to work. Like, 
Ma I don't know. Maybe I'm wrong. Maybe it will work. Pick this up. Uh, yeah. Anyway, you guys are probably getting tired of me hanging in there. Uh, rambling on. So, and running around in like a pointless video, but... Yeah. Attention, Dunwall Shut up. Citizen. Nobody cares. You are reminded I know that. that assaulting know that. a member of the city watch has been made a capital um, offense, and guardsmen are yeah, authorized okay. to carry out this there. sentence. Yes, yeah, so I just spot. don't know. The I'm kind of repeating myself now. Legally forfeit. So, leave a comment. What do you guys think? I gotta get that. Oh, whoa, whoa, whoa. Shit, that's close. What do you guys think? Is this a good idea? Is it a bad idea? Or do you even care? I don't know. Tell me if you care or not, or, like, if you think it's a good idea, bad idea. See, I'm rambling the same thing on. It is definitely time. Um, yeah, so. I really don't need to close that. What was that? Screw me. Yeah, so. I don't know. Leave a comment, like the video, favorite, subscribe, etc. Um, thank you for watching. And with that. I will see you later on Gamescom news. I should have said that. I should have said Gamescom at the beginning of the video and I didn't. Uh, I don't know. Maybe I'll talk about PlayStation next time. Or the NX. I would like to do the NX. What is screaming? Anyway, yeah. Uh, it's scary. You scared the shit out of me. Um, yeah, so thank you for watching. Hopefully you have enjoyed and I will see you next time.